Kaboom! Yes, guys, welcome to the channel and to my base review series. This is where we find some of the best bases out there. We test them out in the Legend League, we review them, and then we give them a score out of 10, guys. That's how it works. So, welcome to the channel. And today, we're going to be reviewing this Town Hall 13 Legend League and War Base. And, guys, this channel is the place to be for awesome base designs. I've got millions of base designs, not millions, I've got lots, lots of base designs coming your way so do make sure you hit that subscribe button and join the samus army yes so then in a moment we're going to check out some awesome legend league replays so you can actually see this base in action see how it performs if you are impressed guys and you do want to download and try this base it's easy just head on over to the video description click on the base layout link and kaboom yes the base will appear on your device just like that guys do remember as well on this channel is something called channel memberships is where you can help support the channel in return you get behind the scenes access to all things regarding the channel an awesome badge next to your name and at least once a month i'll give you a professionally built custom base from clash champs that you guys can take away and use all the information about joining is in the video description anyway enough of me talking let's jump into some replay so through the clouds we appear let's have a look at our first attack and what do we got guys we've got some yetis which is bowlers, yeah. Looks like a pretty powerful attack strategy here. So what's going on then? And by the way, guys, this was filmed just before the June update. So you're not going to see any of the new super troops or new levels on the heroes. Or the headhunter, yes. Very interesting troops. So anyway, sorry guys, yes. Back to the action. So what's happening here then? So uh, there has a breach in the walls there. They're going into the base. Are they going to go towards the town hall though? Uh, the wall wrecker has unfortunately been destroyed. There's a jump spell trying to entice the troops over to that town hall. But there, no, here come the ice golem and Larry the Lava Hound, my clan castle troops. And poison spell may be put down a little bit too early. And now the lava pups are all over those heroes. And that queen is thinking, oh no, I should have just left Larry the Lava Hound alone. But now uh, Gary the Ice Golem has moved, yep, frozen. And that queen is being infernoed and unfortunately her time on the battlefield has come to an end so that's the first replay guys over quite quickly on to the next one what do we got here then we've got some balloons healers dragons yeah i like the look of this attack strategy guys it looks interesting so just speed it up a bit trying to uh nothing seems to be happening oh here we go guys so baby dragon in the top right hand corner the king on the left hand side there trying to create a little bit of a funnel by the looks of things this is okay we're patient guys uh, you know when when replays start like this not much happens at the beginning guys it's time to just relax practice your breathing techniques in out just it makes you attack better if you're relaxed anyway sorry into the action ice golem and lava hound are out larry flying towards the royal champion to be annoying that baby dragon on the right has just taken an air mine to the nostril out of action and uh, that poor royal champion is doomed she's been expoed uh, lava hounded whatever the lava hounds do they f attack with something and yep gary the ice golem is strolling away happy he's done a job well done there oh, well no that's not it doesn't matter guys you know what i mean you know what i mean the Queen's turn now. She's being raged and healed. And now Larry the Lava Hound is there. Exploded. Gary the Ice Golem. And this uh, Clan Castle combination, as you can see, guys, is pretty effective. With the Ice Golem and the Lava Hound, especially now, there's just been a Lava Hound buff. They've got a couple of more defensive units and uh, more health. So they're going to be even more aggressive. And those Lava Pups, look, they're just taking out the uh, healers. And now... They're going to fly off somewhere else. Just have a poor healer there. And what they do, they just... Yep, yeah, they're off. Where are they going, guys? They're targeting somebody over there. They're off after that. It's minion versus lava pups. Who's going to win? Uh, two of... Oh, it doesn't matter. They have no chance. No chance at all. That was unfair. So the main bulk of the army pushing forward now. Battle blimp over there. Just flown out the forest. I do believe the battle blimp uh, appeared from under the waterfall. That was quite beautiful. It's just... Oh, no. An air mine. Yep, everybody's out of that battle, but we didn't get very far. And now the attack looks in danger. Can they get to the town hall? And, guys, 
You know what it's like on a windy day, getting blown back by the air sweeper. How annoying is that? And the air sweeper's done a great job there. That's Andy, the air sweeper. Well done, Andy, pushing those troops away. They're all being inferno'd. The Grand Warden is powerless to stop this. We've got a dragon over there on the right and a minion. Uh, who's that? It's Bob. Bob the minion. Uh, just annoying that dragon, just flying on top of his head there. And unfortunately, Bob has been taken out. So 15 seconds left. Let's just admire the battlefield. Look at the beautiful trees, guys. Have you tried out the new layouts? What do you think of the new update? Let me know in the video comments, of course. So anyway... Uh, just two seconds left, and yeah, there we go, guys. There we go. So, we've got one more replay for you today, I think. Let me just check. Sorry, guys, I should know this. Yep, yeah, one more. One more replay. So, what's going to happen here? What do we got? Yetis, bowlers, max level heroes. Or what were max level heroes, they're not anymore. Four earthquake spells opening up the base there. Quite magnificent. Town hall has been activated. Queen on the right. E Dragon on the left. Queen Walk activated. You don't normally see Queen Walks that often anymore. It's quite rare. Um, normally people go with Grand Warden Walks. So, yeah, just relax now, guys. Just admire uh, the battlefield. And uh, that Electro Dragon clearing the corner over there. And now the Queen is going to try and take out the enemy Royal Champion. This is where those new troops, the Headhunters, would be very useful. And this is looking good, isn't it? That's a nice funnel, guys. I'm going to give that funnel 9 out of 10. A classic funnel there. And now the troops are going to the base. Is the wall wrecker going to be okay? Yeah, it looks like it. Looks like it's going to be okay, guys. Pushing through into the base. And the town hall is in danger. The wall wrecker has been destroyed. Larry the Lava Hound and the Ice Golem out. But, the, yeah, it looks like yeah, the town hall, unfortunately, is going to fall now. It's down. We've lost the town hall, guys. This is not good. Not good at all. Um, solitary bowler over there. Left three bowlers out the arena. That looked like a synchronised diving competition. It was quite magnificent, really. And could this be the three-star attack? I'm not going to tell you guys. You've got to guess. There was one three-star attack, I believe, against this base. And could this be it? Larry the Lava Hound is trying his best to... Uh, put off the attackers there's a few bowlers there one healer just keeping them topped up uh, health wise and that single target inferno has gone guys it is not good the base is in danger it's a beautiful looking base by the way and uh, after this replay we will be summarizing how the base did in the legend league and giving it a score out of 10 guys yeah so uh, it's going to be close i wish larry the lava hand would do a bit more he's just hovering there what we could really do with now would be the Grand Warden to take out the Lava Hound. But he's not going to because, yeah, if they did, this would not be three stars. But guys, you must have guessed it by now. It's going to be three stars. As painful and as, it, as it is to watch, uh, I do like to show the three star attacks. Just to give you a better understanding of how the base performs. And obviously show you how to try and take down the base if you come up against it. Yeah, of course. So 97%, 15 seconds left. And uh, Larry the Lava Hound, I, uh, not really, uh, just being annoying really. You know when you've got a, a fly in the house, it's just harmless. But they're just annoying, aren't they? Or can be. Boom. There we go, guys. So we'll head back now and see how the base did in the Legend League. Let's go. So here it is, guys. Here's the Legend League defense log for the base. We're going to scroll through so you can check out all the defenses. And guys, all of these replays were filmed prior to the recent June update. Just letting you know about that. So anyway, 14 attacks over a two-day period in the Legend League. Of those 14 attacks, 3 were 1-star, 10 were 2-star, and 1 was a vicious 3-star attack. So performance-wise, not too bad, guys. Lots of low percentage 2-star attacks, a few 1-star attacks. Yeah. We can work with that. We did have that one three-star attack that we've just watched. But if anybody attacks you without any jump spells or without any earthquake spells, they are in trouble. So what are we going to give it out of 10, guys? What do you think? I think we're going to give this base out of 10. Not going to tell you. We're going to go look at the Builder Hall because I became distracted there. Back to the base. Oh, yes. Out of 10 today, guys. We're going to be giving this base 7 out of 10. 
And guys, do remember if you haven't hit that subscribe button, do hit the subscribe button now and the notification bell. Join the Samus Army. We're going to have loads of awesome base designs coming your way. You get channel exclusives from the professional base builders over at Clash Jabs. Yes, guys. Yes. Anyway, this is Samus signing out. I hope you've enjoyed the video. I will catch you later.